Hey guys, welcome back to Fast Panda Gaming for the final mission from Operation Caldstrom. So we'll jump over to uh, Studio A in a few minutes and watch the Claw take on his unwilling volunteer uh, for the final time. Uh, before we do that, we are going to just run through the couple of new rules that this mission introduces and uh, let our Fast Panda Geist set the scene uh, before we watch Lewis beat the Claw yet again. Hopefully. So, two new rules this time around, and they're kind of similar. Uh, they are Doctor and Medikit. Now, every Doctor will have a Medikit, but not everyone with a Medikit is a Doctor. I think that's the right way around. So, with a Doctor, if they are in base-to-base -base contact with a model that is unconscious, they can spend a short skill, pass a whip roll, and that model will return to the conscious state and uh, be back, active, provide orders, all of that. Medikits work similarly, but they can be fired at range and they require the target, i.e. the person who is currently unconscious, to pass a physique roll to recover. If either the whip roll or the physique roll has failed, that model is dead. Removed from the table, cannot be brought back. So it's very much an all or nothing type play. I'm sure we'll see it come up in the mission. So uh, let's jump into that and uh, see who needs to be revived. So the forces for this mission... For Pano, they have the three just trusty fusiliers that they've had throughout. Uh, the Orc, which is still the Lieutenant. That uh, devastating Knight of Justice with his Spitfire. The Nookin with his boarding shotgun. And the new troop for this mission is the Infirmera of St. Lazarus, with, who is a doctor with a combi rifle. It's the new addition that uh, Pano have for this round. For Yu Jing, again, the core is still going to be that trio of Zanshi. Then backing them up they have the Zhuzhak, uh, the Dao Fei with Spitfire who is still the Lieutenant, the Hundun Sniper and the new addition they've got this time around is the Guilang who has a boarding shotgun and an MSV-1 so he's there as a counter to the uh, Noken. Objectives for this mission. Main objective is to control the central module, that central building uh, on the board with a secondary objective of one point for every enemy trooper that is eliminated up to a maximum of 10. Something to bear in mind though that central module is contested by Liang Kai. He is going to be a neutral model that counts both sides as hostile so he will react with a ballistic skill attack ARO against anyone he gets line of sight to. So being the first onto that building may not be the best thing because you have to deal with him as well as your opponent. Members of the Order of St. Lazarus were doctors first and foremost. However, Master Sergeant Niels Carlson was also a soldier, serving on active duty in Svalahama Winterfall. When the intrusion alarm started blaring, he grabbed his medikit and rifle, knowing that his Winterfall comrades would be in more immediate need of medical care than his charges in the infirmary. Sporadic fire was chipping the wall around him, but Niels was not phased as he raced ahead. He had twin duties to attend to, both as a healer and a defender of Pan-Oceania. He caught a glimpse of movement in his peripheral vision and turned to see a flash of Eugene winter camouflage and the barrel of a shotgun swinging in his direct. Hi guys, so this is the deployment map for Mission 5. Now as you can see, the ends are different this time. So when you do your whip roll to see who gets the initiative, it's a little bit more of a choice. So going first is all well and good. Uh, making your opponent go second is, is great. But now you've got to think, do I want this end or do I want that end? Because that could be could matter. Deployment is a big thing, reading the battlefield and that kind of stuff is always a big thing in any game. Uh, deployment can win or lose you a game. So you've got to think, large building there, that's great. Deployment zone is here. So when you deploy on it, Unless you've got uh, forward deployment, you're not getting up to this edge. Maybe it might be nice if you've got some forward deployment. Put a sniper up there. Or, has your opponent got a sniper? Do you want to deny them that area? Do you want to go there just to deny your opponent? You've also got two smaller buildings that you can make into Fort Kickass. You've got, you can easily get the cover straight away, you don't have to move. So your ARO pieces can go straight into these buildings with cover, great lines of sight. 
So these are things you've got to start thinking about when you actually set in, uh, when you actually do your whip roll. Do you want to go first with those evil Spitfires? Because one way or another, the Spitfires are going to so, so murder again. Because again, other than this corridor here, is very short lines of uh, lines of fire. So that's something to have a look at. And uh, so what we'll do is we'll get straight into it with a rip roll. Let's see who's going first or picking a side to deploy. Okay, so let's do a whip roll. I've got a whip of 13, 14, I fail. You win, you get to choose deployment or who goes first? Deployment. You're gonna choose deployment. Okie dokie, let's see where we go. Okay, with Lewis choosing to deploy second on the opposite side, I've had to deploy first and I'm going first. So, I've got a camo token behind that uh, billboard. I have a camo token on the stairs. I've got a Zanshi running down the side. I'm hoping she's not going to get any lines of sight. Zanshi hiding behind here. Another Zanshi covering fire there. I've got the Yuzhak hiding behind this large one. And further up, I've got another camo there. So I've got three camos this time, which is nice. I'm not going to say which one's which, uh, but the genius in Wuxia will probably know which one's which. Um, right, so that's my deployment. Let's get and see what the Pano deployments are like. Okay, so Pano have uh, set up. Uh, we've got two defensive little castles. We've got one with a fusilier in it. And we've, down here we've got uh, the Orc Lieutenant, another fusilier and another fusilier holding the center. Over to the side, we've got the uh, Knight with Spitfire. We've got the hospital, uh, the Infirmary Doctor at the bottom, just in case anybody falls over, he can start healing this time. And we've got the knocking there, hiding behind there, ready to come out blasting. So in the center, we have the token that represents Lanky, but we have actually got the model. So we can swap that over and pop the proper model in the center. And he just basically AROs everybody and he's got 360 worth of vision. So you can't sneak up behind him. He'll just blast you anyway. Okay, so we're both set up both sides. Let's see how we get on. Just so you know, I've put little numbers next to all the camo guys uh, on my sheet. So I, uh, it's basically fair and I know who's who and you can't swap over. It's just something for courtesy. I don't have to show my opponent, but, um, or, or do you encode one? Do you, Storm? Let me know. Anyway, we're not. So, camo token time. So first one, I'm gonna start off with that Lieutenant before he dies and I'll lose it. So let's get to, uh, so let's get stuck into the lieutenant. Okay, so number four, that's my Dao Fei. I'm going to move this way and a little bit around the edge to about here. So all I can see is that poor fusilier. Come on, follow me. This fusilier here. Okay, so that fusilier gets an ARO. What would you like to do? Ooh, delay. Delay? Okay, my second is going to shoot. What are you going to do now? Shoot. So shoot and shooting, shoot and shoot and shoot. Oh, it's surprise attack and all sorts. Of. Okay, let's, so let's have a measure. Uh, I'm definitely within 24 for my good range. Are we in 16 for your good range? Easily. So we're plus three, minus three each way. So it's flat rolls essentially, apart from, minus I've, from got, I've got mimetism and I've got surprise shot. So you're minus six. Okay, so we just remembered that there's a mad monk on top of the roof and he's got to be able to see me and you know what? I don't think he can. You can see my sword. But my sword's a lot higher than the silhouette, so I'm gonna say no. Okay, so the fusilier at minus six. Sevens or more, that's some of them, sevens. Nope. Nope. So I've got thirteens or less. Yes, yes. Two. Two, Two armour, roll the dice, and we'll do the math in a second. Well, we're going to have to do the maths. You've got uh, three points of armour, so yeah, you're good. You have three points of cover plus one point of armour. Yeah, you're fine. You know that again, aren't you? Uh, yes, I am, but you've only got minus three to hit me this time. So you're on nines. A two, a seven, a seven. It's three hits. Dead. Dead. Okay, six orders left. So many orders compared to the other ones. Right. 
So I'm going to activate this number camo, number one, which is my multi sniper. He moves 4-4, four, four, which gets me comfortably up to the edge. And the monkey can see you now. Nice, no, I can't. Ooh. Now, delay. How many arrows have we got? We've got, I can see over there, I can see the orc, I can see a fusilier, I can see the hospitaller, and I can see the knight. And you can see the monk. And the monk. So, the monk is going to shoot, because that's what the monk does. Because he's just crazy. What's all your guys going to do? Delay. You're all going to delay? Yes, yeah, because you got the best range, well, the lieutenant. Okay, I'm going to move. Uh, how that works for the monk, the monk would have to discover. So the monk's going to do a discover and I'm going to move. Okay, so the monk's got, uh, monk's going to do a discover and he's, go, uh, he's going to uh, 14 whip. So flat roll, it's over 18, 11, discover me. Okay, so the way I work it out is that um, he's on a different team to those, those guys. Those guys deferred, delayed. So they, I didn't do an attack against them, so they can't shoot me. That's how I'm working the rules out on this one. I might be wrong. Storm Shroud, put the text on the screen if I'm wrong. But we end up there, okay? The monk can now see me, so uh, he, he can start shooting next time. So that's another order gone. But as I go down now, I don't see the orc anymore, but I do see the other three. And as far as an ARO piece goes, those three move, I get to snipe them. So yeah, I'm happy with him there. Okay, next order. I'm going to go here, ever so slightly, until I get to a point where I can see the lady, lady fuser there, but not the orc. Still in cover. So I can see that fuselier over here, come funny. So I can see this fuselier over here, but not that orc. What are you going to do? Unfortunately, guys, the footage of the next couple of orders has been lost. But in what I am assured was a gunfight fit for state empire propaganda, as Zhuzhak tried to take on the Fusilier, but the odds were against him, and he fell. The Chloraki said something about bleeding dice gods, but we're, we're going to jazz it up a bit. Back to the action. Okay, so last order. This is Anshi. Nobody can see her where she is. So it's going to come around here, two and two. Yep, you saw me. And then just a bit up further up here, just to be ready. That's it. And we're now going on to Panoceana, round one. Okay, so. First order, spent. Who are you spending it on? The knight shooting the monk and sniper. The knight shooting the monk. And the sniper. Okay, uh, I've got cover and mimetism, so I'm minus six on the uh, on the sniper. You, I've just got cover, so you've got minus three. The monk's got nothing, so you do, uh, monk's got mimetism at minus three. Okay, so let's work, work out some uh, numbers and we'll roll some dice. Okay, so we've done some measuring and we're all within sixteen inches. Which is not much fun for the night uh, for the sniper. So that's on zero range of band. I am minus three for the for the night. So I'm hitting you on tens for the sniper. One dice AP uh, for this particular mission. Uh, the night the monk is in good range. So he's plus three minus three for your range. He's on straight rolls. His phys his ballistic skill is eleven. The knight is shooting back at the. It's only 11 minutes for your sniper, he's on 14, 14s for the monk. Oh, 11s? Minus 3 overall? Wow. And that knight is, is good, with yeah, words. the BS is 14. Okie dokie, let's roll some dice. Okay, so my sniper shoots you once. 10s, 18, I miss. You shoot me twice. One hit. One hit. 10. I've just got comeback, I've got three armour, so that gives Wait, me six. Sniper. So tens are cool. Wait, three armour for the sniper? Three armour for the sniper, yeah. Oh yeah, because they were hey. shooting with the, they were shooting with the orc. Right, so the sniper survived. The mad monk! Mad monk shoots! Mad monk misses! Uh, 
I hit twice. Hit twice! Save twice! Do that again then. Okay, alright, so sniper! Hits on a seven! So it wipes that one out. Well, it still gets me on a ten. Dead. Ooh, ah! Dead. Unconscious. Okay. And the Mad Monk shoots. Misses. No. <laughs> Who's celebrating shooting the sniper? In all the excitement, we missed an ARO. Now, that far, I'd have been hitting you on fours, so the best I would have done is dodge. You're doing dodges now, though? I'm just going to, I will do one dodge and that'll cover everything. So just to be fair, because these things happen, you do miss arrows. And between myself and Lewis, we've agreed just one dodge just to cover it. Okay, so uh, the Zanshi's going to dodge to catch up. No. He doesn't dodge. What a surprise. He didn't dodge. It's all good. We're all happy. Okay, so another order down. And again, you're going to use the knight. The knight is going to shoot the Zanshi, who hasn't been moving at all. The Zanshi is going to dodge laughably. The monk is going to shoot you. Oh yeah, for the monk. So what are you going to do for your second part? What's the... Yeah, you, you get to tell me what you're doing with the second half of your order. How are you going to split your burst? Two and the monk, two and you guys. Two and two again. Okie dokie. Okay, so we've just measured up and we're still within 24 inches because those Spitfires are lethal in this game. I dodged on a nine. Ha! So what do I need? Four. More than nine, less than whatever you need. No. I dodged! Hey! <laughs> I dodged there. So I can't be seen now from the Spitfire, evil Spitfire. He lived. Okay, Kang Lai. Kang Lee. Lanky. Lanky. Monk. Yeah, the monk. He's going to shoot. On a 12. Isn't that it? No, I think it's 11. It's 11s. Yeah, it's 11s. Yeah, it's 11s. He misses. Oh, that's a shame. Go on. I crit. Yeah, I cr Yeah. Crit and a hit. Wait, do we, does he have minutism though? Yes, he does have minutism. So it's, minus, it's minus three overall. So that's not a crit, that's a miss. So that's miss a mi hit. Miss and a hit. So that's a hit. 16. Yeah, I can take it. That, um, he's not very good at shooting, but he's hard as nails. And you just moved another token across. Firing four rounds in four rounds, four rounds this time, so the Mag Monk's going to shoot. 13, misses. Your uh, ballistic cell of 15, is it? No, 14. 14, so. I would need 11. That's a miss. Three hits. Yep. Got me! Oh, moving. Moving? Who are you moving? Knight. The knight. Nobody can see him. Because you've shot everybody. Where's the knight moving to? There. Oh, he's just moving back. Yes, because I know what you're going to be doing with your, with your own Spitfire. You need a bit of flanking, so then he can see. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, you, you're on the top of the... Uh, so zooming in, like drone. So these two are now in line, so I can't pick them off one by one, at least. Fair enough. Okay, so next to last uh, regular order, or well, last regular order. I just realised that. What? He's not in cover if your Spitfire gets close. Yeah, that would do. Would it work? If I move to the, the next one, yep. First move to there-ish. He was touching that, so yeah. Next, then four, four. To there. Okie dokie. None of my guys saw you anyway. Okay, and you have a lieutenant's order left. Are you going to do anything with your lieutenant, or is he just going to sit there? Hmm. He can move six. He can move six. Six two. Okay, your fusilier blocks his line of sight. Is it? I believe so. Again, Storm Shred, pop the text on the screen. And so he's ran, ran away over to that corner to what is quickly becoming Fort Kickass. Okie dokie. 
You're out of orders. You're using round two. Lieutenant's order. I'm going to move my Daufei. And he's going to move. He's going to move there. To about there. Then I'm going to fire. You will have your orc and two. Firing both. All three. Uh, firing all three? Yes. Okie dokie. Let's have a look at some ranges while you've still got the camera in your hand. 16, 16. Over 16. Yeah, that has stopped me before to kill him with the orc. Okie dokie. Let's roll some dice. Okay. I didn't say what are we doing. I'm going to dodge. Still so, shoot. You're still shooting, so do your shooting. So, fusiliers. You can do both fusiliers at the same time because they're the same, really. 12. Because I'm out of cover. Well, plus, he has mimetism, doesn't he? He does have mimetism. So uh, you are plus three for range, minus three for mimetism. So you are straight rolls of 12. A four. A four gets me. The 18, doesn't he? And your orc. He's plus three for range. Sorry, he's minus three for range, minus three for mimetism. He's minus six overall. Eight. Okay. What's his what's his ballistic? Fourteen. Fourteen. Minus six. Eight. Yep. Yeah. So more than I need to dodge more than four, less than fourteen. That'll do it. I live. We move two though. I'm not sure <laughs> yet. Okay, so I have got a three inch dodge. Now what I want to do is I want to move out of the way and into cover. So I'm gonna go here. I've got lots of dodge movement, but this gets me into a nice position where if I came too round, further around here, I would have ended my turn with other guys seeing me and they would have had another ARO at me, which I don't, didn't really want. So if I just go here, the only thing that can really see me now is that little fusilier over there. So guess what? Come over here. See this order? Yep, firing. Firing. You're firing at me. Okie dokie. Okay, so you are plus three for your range, minus three for cover, minus three. So you are minus three overall because of my mimetism. So that would be nine. Nines, yes. Ten. Yeah. Well, hey! Yeah, that's a lot of death. Uh, I was plus three, minus three, so I'm straight rolls. So that is three hits. Okay, so three armor saves. Dead. Yeah, unfortunately, you've got three, four. You needed, yeah, you needed more than more than that. You needed more than ten or eleven. Which one was it? It's that one. Dead. You ain't healing that. One. Okay, so next order. I'm going to see how big my balls are. So one with a yell and knocking everything flying. Is there? You have, for my reckoning, two AROs. One from the infirmary and one from the knight. Discover. From the knight. Uh, delay. Well, that mean I get to shoot you for the discover you. Yeah. Then delay then. Okay. So you need to discover. Uh... Okay. So after much thinking. Uh, I could have dodged and get an extra bit of a movement uh, if I get discovered because that discovery of a 13 is going to be good. Uh, we are going to measure it in a second. I'm going to move. So you are within eight. So you've got plus three to that range. So you are going to discover me on a 16. So I'm going to move. So you need to roll, so you can discover. So, do you discover me? No. 17. Wow! Whew. Okay, next order. I'm going to move. Into cover. Then I'm just going to discover again. Well, you, your choices are discover with your infirmary when he was when he could see him. So that's fine, because he's not going to do... Because where I am now, you know, I'm not going to shoot you. Probably not. Um, and you're knocking. 
he couldn't see me. He had his back to me. Well, there was one of those other ones that way. Like pointing at the wall. Sorry? It's pointing at the wall, isn't it? Where's his other one? Where's his other side? I don't know. I think he's pointing at the wall. Yeah, okay, you, you, you could see. You, I thought I was further back than him, because I thought I was here, which meant I was out of your line of sight. It was okay. I'm behind him. So now you can't be seen. Mm. Still going to discover then. Still going to discover? Okie okay, dokie. I'm going to shoot, shoot the knocking, so you discovered me, it makes no difference. I'm going to shoot the knocking in the back of the head twice. Okay, so I've come out of my camo state, so it's a surprise shot. I'm surprise shotting the knocking, who's not looking this way. And I was never in his arc, uh, in his arc so he can, all he can do is dodge. Dodge it at minus three. I am plus six for my range, minus six for your minus, minus six mimetism, so I'm straight rolls of 11, unfortunately, so I'm not that good shot. So, let's uh, roll some dice. I miss, you don't dodge. Mm. I needed 11s. I got a 12. Oh, two dice. Yeah, okay. You just put two fingers up at me. A one! Thanks for that. <laughs> Is that AP? One save, yeah. Is that an AP weapon? Okay. So four. Nope. One shot to the back of the head. That'll do nicely. Next order. This guy. He's going to move 4-4 four, because four, nobody can see me. So I'm going to go straight up to this building. That one? You sure the verdict couldn't? No, no, go on. No, 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 just nobody can see me. And the next one, I'm going to go to uh, move this one. Your point. Just here. Yeah, point. Yeah, you're just going to, she's just going to go here and she's going to sit there. You're, you're the... Okay, so at the end of my round, I've moved a bit. I've got a good position with the shotgun. I've got a good position with the uh, Spitfire. So let's see what Pano can do in their second round. Okay, so next order. Jumping down. Jumping down for full order. Da -da. He's disappeared. I didn't get any arrow from that. So next order. Let's go on. Loads of room. So you're coming up to the edge, so you can see me, you're still in cover. I'm going to shoot. I'm within eight inches, so I get plus six, minus three overall because of the cover. So I am plus three overall. You are. Everybody's on 14s because um, I am plus three overall. Six. That's okay. You are uh, plus three, minus three. How many beat the six? That didn't beat the six. That's equal to the six. That is uh, beaten by the six. So, and that's a miss. So the two sixes wipe each other out. Doing it again? No. You're in within six. You are charging into me. Yep. Like a lunatic. Okie dokie. I'm going to shoot you on the way in. Okay. Okay, so you ran in like a lunatic uh, with sword, sword swinging. I'm going to shoot you. I'm going to shoot you on my plus, three, six, uh, plus six range round. Nine. So I need nine. Your close combat is? 23. 23. So it's a roll plus three. Well, that's shit. Well, do, uh, you have, do you want to live the armor state because you're going to hit me first before no, I start? No, no, it's all simultaneous. So what I need to be that? You're going to need a six because you're plus three on that 23. Yep. 12, yeah, you, you get me. Uh, but it's not a crit. It's not a crit. Okay, so, according to the Kulstrom book, martial arts is not included, so we've, we've ignored that. Uh, physique is, because you're close combat, it's, it's physique, 14. I've got one armour, so I need 14s. Mm. Yes! Yeah. Two! Roll. You beat it. Whatever you roll. 20. That's a crit. Because, uh, yeah, 17, 18, 19, no, 18, 19, and 20s are all quits. So you crit. 9 and 10, I'm dead. Okay, last order. The orc. 
Where are you going with him? Charging forward. It might mean he... So at six, I don't get any IROs. Now I couldn't see him from my way if he, if he dart straight forward. And he's into cover. He's happy. Setting him up for a run towards the centre at the end. Okay, so I'm going to move my Daufei first. Because I've really got to get onto that roof to cause some, uh, to cause some uh, problems. So, my Daufei is 6-2. So, three to there and another three to meet my mate around the corner. I don't believe anybody saw me. In fact, I'll go here. Next order. This one, because it's a full order. I'm going to climb. And I get to climb six inches. Wait, there's no ladder, is there? No, there's no ladder, but I'm going to climb. How? Jumping and climb is a full order. Jumping and climbing is a full order. Mm -hmm. So a full order to get me there. Have you got any AROs? Um, the knight? No, the medic? The medic will definitely see me. Yeah, it's just the medic. Just the infirmary. What's he going to do? Wait, uh... You'll always see him. I've just had a quick look down there and no, I don't think so. Okay. That's why I went to the back. Shooting. Shooting? Nothing I can do, that was a full order. Okay, so I'm not in cover from there, so it's plus three for the range, minus three for my memory system. Straight roll. 13. Hit me. Wounded me too. Okay, so perhaps I should have done this first. Because I'm going to move up a little bit. Shooting. So my head is just popping over. I can't see anybody else. In fact, I'll go back back down a bit more to there. No, that's fine. Let's go there. All I can see. Oh, I can see the fusilier as well. There's no way I can't get out of that fusilier because there's a little dip in this here, and I can see that fusilier and that is forever. So I can see that fusilier. So I can do that, and I can see him as well. Because if you come, come down here, you can see, head out, you can see that fusilier. Yep, Hello. Can see him and I can head. see that one. So what are you going to do? Fire. Fire with? Both. Both. Okay, I'm going to put three, two shots. No, I'm going to put three shots in the infirmer. Wait, what? Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 okay, so what we're going to do first? Fuser there? No, medic. The medic. Okay, so the medic's going to shoot my, me. I'm uh, over 16, so I, and I'm in cover. So I'm minus 6 overall. So... 7. It's not 15. I am a minus 6 overall, so I'm 5. 4 will do it. Roll so. the dice. Roll the dice and we'll work out the math. Sometimes it's easier just to roll the dice and then... No. Nine. Oh, I don't know. You've got three points of damage. You've got three points of armour. No. Oh. How much armour you got? You've got two armour, so it's five overall. You needed eight. You're good. Okay. Because you've got three points of uh, cover, two armour, so it's five. So it's five, so you needed eight. So you're fine. Now for the Now the fusilier is having a pot shot at me. Roll the dice. Seven, you miss. Uh, ooh. No. No, you need sixes. Okay, I'm doing it again. What are you, what, are you shooting me back? Yep. You're both of them? Okay, so all three are going into Infirmer. You are Infirmer is going to? Five. Ten. What's your ballistic skill in your Infirmer? Thirteen. Thirteen, no, you miss. Because I'm minus three, minus six overall. None of those are less than five. Fusilier? 11. Everybody's great. I've got one order left. I'm not going to do that again. Okay, I've got one order left. I could, with my Daufei, shoot the infirmer with the Spitfire, which will be very good. But, but the way my luck is, might be dead. He, you know. This Sanchi could do exactly what he's done for the last two orders. On fives, it's not very good chances. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move this Sanchi to the corner where I can see a knight. Just like that. So, I moved, the knight can see me, the knight is going to... Fire. Fire? 
one shot, I'm going to put three shots into the night. We'll have a measure up and we'll see where we are. Okay, so we are just in 16. You are um, plus three, minus three for, for yours, so your straight roll. 19. I ain't cutting it. I am plus three, minus three, so I need 11. One. So, one armor save. Roll the dice, you've got a m m super, you need really low numbers to actually suffer a wound. Yeah, you're fine. But, I'll shoot you if you move. Okay, so at the end of the Yujing, I am controlling the roof. Yay! Because I'm on the rooftop. Okay, I'm just at the top of the stairs, but I'm on the rooftop. Is that because the point where I'm to in, kill me to get off I'm in, yeah, you, yeah, you need to kill me to get me off the roof. And you are in lots of arrows, so hopefully, hopefully I've got this. Okay, first order. Tonight. Full order to get up there, are you sure? Four shots. Yeah, but that is a full order. You can't get, you can't shoot, you can't climb and shoot. No, I know. I get to shoot you now. I know. Okay. But well, I was trying to cover still. Okay, so I'm going to shoot you back with this Sanchi and I'm going to shoot you with this Spitfire. Okay. Okay, the Sanchi is going to shoot you when you're not in cover. A four, get you. Yeah, your armor's amazing. Um, <laughs> the Spitfire is going to shoot you when you're not in cover. Yep, got you. 15. Oh, uh, I missed an ARO. There's another Zanchi running up the stairs. That way I'd have shot at you. No. Missed anyway. That's what you get for missing AROs. Okay, so super armored knight, like a tank. What are you doing now? Four shots in your Spitfire person. Four shots to the Spitfire. Okay. I'm going to... If I shoot you back, we are within two foot, so we are both plus three. We are both... You're in cover, I'm not. So I'm plus three, minus three. You are plus three, minus three for my minimalism. So we are both straight rolls. You get four shots, I get one. Um, hmm. Okay, so physique is 14, my ballistic would be 13, so 5% in it, but I'm gonna dodge. I'm gonna dodge on a 14. Okay, so I'm dodging on a 14. Four, I do dodge. So more than four, less than your ballistic. Two. Right, so I got four. And that's a four, so they wipe each other out. Those are misses. That is a one hit. Ten. Uh, I think that gets me. Okay, I've got four points of armor. I've got no cover from where I am, because I'm not studying cover. I needed more than ten, and that is a ten. I die. Okay, they're both within sixteen. You, so I'm plus three, minus three. Two hits, nine and a ten. No, no, Two dice. Four. Four gets you, dude. I'm dead. How many wounds you got? Two. So just one wound. So you got me with two bullets, though. The seven. I think you saved the, saved the seven. Yeah, you saved the seven easily. No, it's one wound. Yeah, but you need more. You needed more than fives, but you got and you got a four, so it's just one wound. Okay, you've got three orders left, two regular and one. So one regular order, you spend it on the night. As you are shuffling, I, I'm going to shoot you back with my two Zanji. What are you going to do? Put two rounds on both. Okay. Okay, Zanji one. The one coming up the stairs. He's going to shoot you on a four. Get you on a four. So more than four, less than 14. Ha! <laughs> You're going to be annoyed, aren't you? Because I convinced you to do this. No. Yeah, you're safe. You're fine. And then she two. No. This is two hits. Uh, I'm good because I'm in cover. It was worth a go. Okay. Okay. So your lieutenant's order. Six two. Okay. Nobody can see him where he is. So he's running to the bottom of the stairs. He could. 
Don't think she could because it's it really is. Nah, you're fine. Sixteen gets you to the bottom of the stairs easily. And with your last order, six gets you to, to the top of the stairs. So I get an ARO with that Zanshi. And an ARO with that Zanshi. So I'm telling you, I'm going to shoot you twice. You have three shots back. What are you going to do? Or you can just dodge. Two shots, one shot. Two shots in the one on the top of the stairs and one shot in the one on the back. Okie dokie. Okay, so uh, my Zanshis are shooting you on plus three range, minus three for cover. So, uh, focus. Focus, there we are. So we are on roll. So Zanshi on the stairs is going to miss you. You said you're going to put two shots into that. Two hits. Uh, 13 with one point. I'm, I'm okay. I need, I need a tens or more, so I'm good. Love that one was far away. The one that's far away. Hit you on an eight. That's good. That's good. Not as good as a nine. Nine. Ah, uh, you just got me. Just. Okay, so the dust settles. I have two dudes alive. So that meant five died. So that's five points to you, Lewis. You're on the roof. Because uh, I died on the roof. Uh, so another four points. So it's nine points to you. I killed three people. So it's nine three to you. I'm sure if I've got it wrong, I'm sure sure Storm Shadow will correct me. But I believe it's 9-3 to the Pan Oceania. Thanks for watching all five missions. I hope it's okay. Happy hobbying. And um, let's paint the diaphos next.